The Capuchin monkeys are New World monkeys of the subfamily Sebini. They are readily identified as the organ grinder monkey. The range of Capuchin monkeys includes some tropical forests in Central America and South America as far south as northern Argentina. In Central America, where they are called white-faced monkeys, Cariblanca, they usually occupy the wet lowland forests on the Caribbean coast of Costa Rica and Panama and deciduous dry forest on the Pacific coast. Capuchins are black, brown, buff or whitish, but their exact color and pattern depends on the species involved. Capuchin monkeys are usually dark brown with a cream off-white coloring around their necks. They reach a length of 12 to 22 inches, with tails that are just as long as the body. On average, they weigh from 1.4 to 4 kilograms, 3 to 9 pounds, and live up to 25 years old in their natural habitats. Like most New World monkeys, Capuchins are diurnal and arboreal. With the exception of a midday nap, they spend their entire day searching for food. At night, they sleep in the trees, wedged between branches. They are undemanding regarding their habitat and can thus be found in many different areas. The Capuchin Monkey feeds on a vast range of food types, and is more varied than other monkeys in the family Sebidae. They are omnivores, and consume a variety of plant parts such as leaves, flower and fruit, seeds, pit, woody tissue, sugarcane, bulb, and exudates, as well as arthropods, mollusks, a variety of vertebrates, and even primates. Recent findings of old stone tools and capuchin habitats have suggested that Recently the Capuchins have switched from small nuts, such as cashews, to larger and harder nuts. Capuchins have been observed to also be particularly good at catching frogs. They are characterized as innovative and extreme foragers because of their ability to acquire sustenance from a wide collection of unlikely food, which may assure them survival in habitats with extreme food limitation. Capuchins living near water will also eat crabs and shellfish by cracking their shells with stones. Capuchin monkeys often live in large groups of 10 to 35 individuals within the forest, although they can easily adapt to places colonized by humans. The wide-headed capuchin groups are led by both an alpha male and an alpha female. Each group will cover a large territory, since members must search for the best areas to feed. Capuchins prefer environments that give them access to shelter and easy food, such as low-lying forests, mountain forests, and rainforests. They are particularly abundant in Argentina, Brazil, Costa Rica, Honduras, Paraguay, and Peru. They use these areas for shelter at night and food access during the day. The canopy of the trees allows for protection from threats. Above and the capuchin monkey's innate ability to climb trees with ease allows them to escape and hide from predators on the jungle floor. Capuchin monkeys are clever and easy to train. As a result, they are used to help people who are quadriplegics in many developed countries. They have also become popular pets and attractions for street entertainment. The capuchin is considered to be the most intelligent new world monkey and is often used in laboratories. The tufted monkey is especially noted for its long-term tool usage, one of the few examples of primate tool use other than by apes and humans. Thank you for watching the video from EarthXP.